Hey guys, in this video I'll teach you how to replace or detect the URL of a text to put it on HTML code for example here on, on YouTube for example here in this part uh, we insert all, uh, like a normal text and YouTube converts uh, this to a link Okay, we will do this, but in PHP. For this, we need a code editor and then uh, a local server. Okay, okay, all of this will be on PHP code. Okay, first we put a function. We will call the function uh, URL. And we set it a variable. It will call text. Uh, it will contain all the set it information. So we declare the text variable. That is the same. For a HTML detector, we write HTML underscore entity code and in parentheses the variable that it will receive or detect okay now we write uh, it will write between the detected URL before it will uh, write a ahref and we need to close the tag in HTML so for this we need to put that the text variable will be equals to what it has on, on the information before the variable here here we write the h a h ref and then we'll be write uh, the text so we write the, the variable semicolon okay now uh, we put uh will be a replace code Okay, in this case, it's a um, standard code. So for this, we use this command. It is pref replace. What does uh, this is that it detect uh, if it says HTTP w slash or something of a URL, and it will write it. Okay, here I already have a variable. I put we can put that it will write uh, one. Okay, after I'll explain this. Okay, now we put comma, and now we write to continue searching, to research it when the cycle ends. Close parentheses and semicolon. Okay, now we have to return the modificated uh, text. Is with a return, return the variable text. So. This is the function that it will detect the URL and it will replace it for an HTML URL. Okay, now we will send the text. So we declare a variable, an example. It will be equals to a text. I'll copy any text for this example. And we paste it in here. Okay, this is the text. It will detect automatically the URL and it will convert it. Okay, after this, uh, okay, we create another variable. It will be the final text, which will call the function to edit the, the text. So we put equals URL that is the function and we send it the variable example which have the, the text. There we go. After uh, that we call the URL function, now we will print the modified text. So we put an echo and it will print the final text. That is this. 
which it will be all the modified text. Okay, let's see if it works. Save it. Uh, it says that we have an error on the line 25. Uh, it's a semicolon here. Okay, and that's it. If you see, it sends all all the text. Um, with the converted links. Okay. Now to see a little difference, we will print the example. Echo the variable example to see how it is the original text and then the modified text. We print an a jump line. Okay, refresh the page, and if you see, this is the original text, and then with our function it converts the URLs. Okay, like you see, it's a little code. We only need the function that receive the text that it sends in this part, and also the variable the text all the code. what it receive uh, from the text so from this it will detect the sentence uh, that are after so it will replace before and after the the text with this with this part this is before and this is after okay i'll explain to you this part of variable one this serve used to write the founded text here and here if it found this url it writes here and also here and with this command it replaced the text all the text and the same function returns the text to the variable that call that call it in and also it printed Okay, this file uh, will be on the official page. Mm. If you want all the project, you could download it uh, from the page. It will have a, a little cost. And also, there will be more projects. Uh, which, which also you could download it and you could use it on your projects. Okay, I invite you to, to subscribe to the channel, also to, to share the videos, if you like the videos, also visit my channel, there are more videos about programming. Any question, please leave it in the comments and I'll answer it. Okay, that's it for this video. Bye.